Hi everybody, we have got some amazing news that I just want to share with you. We're going to keep it fairly brief today. There will be much more information coming out in the coming days and weeks. We'll hold AMAs, we'll take questions on Discord, things like that. The big news is that we have found a new home for the EXOS token in Casper Networks. We have searched far and wide. And in order to sort of break this news to you, I went and I talked to Salim Ismail, my co-founder at OpenEXO, and I talked to Mirnal Manohar, the CEO and founder of Casper Labs. So you're gonna hear from them over the next couple of minutes, a little bit about what they think about this migration, what it means and why we're doing it. And then at the end, I'll come in and I'll give you a little bit of practical information about what you should expect next. I'm incredibly excited about this. It's hard to be more excited. We've been waiting for so long for an inflection point like this. Hi, I'm Renal Manohar. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Casper Labs. Casper Labs is an enterprise-grade blockchain company, but the enterprise-grade part of it is more important than the blockchain part of it. We are excited about new and novel technologies and hence excited about our partnership with them. Well, we started talking about this, I think, in 2016. We finally launched it in 2018, suitably on uh, 4 8 1632 on the 4th of uh, 8th of April, 1632. We've had our own blockchain for, what, five, six years now. And over time, and we did it because it was important to learn how to build a blockchain and understand the insides of that so that as a community and as an ecosystem, we could leverage it and not be taken to the cleaners and make proper choices better is a way of learning. And now that we've done that, I think that the opportunity is now to move it to a properly managed L1. Uh, the big, huge reason I'm interested and excited is we've tested and talked to like six other L1s. Um, and finally, uh, we found our home. What I'm really excited about with OpenEXO is it's one of the really few organizations that is trying to get a fundamental understanding of how exponential technologies are going to A, affect business, but also converge. We're at this really unique moment in our history where you know you usually see these decade long, decades long exponential technology curves, but we're seeing blockchain, artificial intelligence, 3D printing, a bunch of things converging all at once. And it is a very, very hard world to navigate. And so we're very excited to be part of OpenEXO because as technology providers who work across blockchain and augmentative technology and AI, this is our raison d'etre. This is what we're here to do. And we're really excited about the migration to the Casper network because we really give an enterprise grade platform to all of you at OpenEXO. And we think to really understand and promote exponential technologies, it's best to eat your own dog food. Yeah, so when we talk to big companies and we talk to hundreds of them and, and governments and heads of state, we need something that is enterprise grade uh, and, and engineered that way from the ground up. I think the Casper ecosystem has been built for uh, rock solid enterprise and government use. And that gives us the stability and robustness we need as to what the future use cases should be and we want to be for our token. I would start by saying it's because we both have big, bold ambitions and we want to do it right. That means you need software that is enterprise grade, meaning you could be one of the largest companies in the world and you know this will work properly. I think we're the right partner because we have the same long-term commitment to delivering excellent products at the highest level of organizations. That's why I think we are ideal partners and we have built our blockchain painstakingly to be enterprise grade so that you know your data, your actions and your transactions are all safe. Oh yeah, very much so. What I what I think both you and I appreciated was their really long-term tokenomics built into the chain for a very long period of time. So uh, that was very appealing. We are an exponential technology organization. We are incredibly impressed with everyone at OpenEXO. Our interactions have been incredibly, not just professional, but incredibly inspiring as well. We're, we're, we're in it for as long as you guys need us to be. I'm honored to be working with such a wonderful organization. It has really been a pleasure interacting with many of you that I've met across this journey. And I'm sure I'll, I'll meet many more of you as time goes by. Uh, please, 
a very, very warm welcome to all of you to the Casper Network and uh, look forward to working with you. Let's go change the world. Now that we've got that out of the way, I hope you're excited. I know we haven't said a lot yet. This might seem kind of sudden for some of you, but it's really good news. If you have Exos today, then the thing you need to do is just be patient. We're only just now kicking off the process to build the migration. And when it's ready, it'll be very simple. You'll take your Exos, you'll put them inside what's called a migration portal, and they will come out the other side in their new home. Again, we'll be sharing a lot more information about this as we go. It's just preliminary now. And we expect from a timeline perspective, this to complete as early as March. Now listen, there's lots of complexities with these things, so don't take that as, some, uh, as an exact exact, but know that this project has kicked off, it is going well, and we couldn't be more excited to get it done.